Okay. Okay, I am recording. All right. <clears throat> Hello and welcome to a special episode of Damage Control Podcasting, a professionally unprofessional look at the conventions, ideas, and genres of filmmaking. The guys wanted to do a particular topic for uh, episode 67. Everyone ended up having to work today, except for Tyler because he's a prick. So I grabbed my kids and my soon-to-be wife, and we are going to do a podcast. Maddie came up with the idea that which we were going to do, which I like, so we're going to work it into the show. So I am here with... Dana. Uh, your boy, Lil Tick. Okay. And, and Abel. And, and then I would like to Okay. And oh. Abel, okay. Yes, Madison, a.k.a. Fred Popsicle 27. Okay. All right, so here's, here's the idea. Here's the idea. I don't understand these kids' generation at all. The music, the way they talk, I don't understand why any of that was funny. So uh, the kids have pulled things from their generation. I have pulled things from me and Dana's generation, and we're going to quiz each other on it and um, see who gets more correctly because me and Dana were around. Well, at least I was around because Dana's like 22 years old. Uh, 32. I... I was around before the internet was even a thing, so I know what it was like, and you guys melt down when you don't even have your phone in your hand, so. So we are gonna go through, we are gonna go through acronyms, slang terms, and things from our generation, okay? Okay. Do you guys wanna go first? Yeah. Um, okay, I'll say yeah. one, Ethan says one, and then you say one. Okay. One. Okay, so I'll go first. Okay. The first one Me and Dana have to guess this. You have to guess what it means. DTW. By, by the way. By the way. Yes. Okay. Okay, you can go. Read the first word. No, you can't look. <laughs> you can't look. Okay, boy, boy tick. What's the first one? No, it's little tick. Oh, sorry. Little tick. <laughs> what's, the, what's the first one? Lit. Uh, uh, same thing as crunk, right? Like drunk. No, no, no! It's cool. It's what the uh, freak is what? Uh, now lit. Uh, you have ten more seconds. The ten. no, the no cussing thing's hard. Um, it's uh, same thing as flick. When your eyebrows are on on flick, it means cool. No. What does it mean? It means like fleek. Hey yo, this party's lit, dog. Yeah, like it's. He oh. just said cool. This no. party's cool. <laughs> no, <this party laughs> amazing. <laughs> Okay. Or like, or like, fantastic, not just cool. Okay. Well, all right. All right. Cool. Here, here's my first one. We, hey, turn, turn that, that off. Okay. Here's our first one. When me and when me and mom had to, uh, when we were young, we had to get on like ICQ and stuff. Madison. A A S L. You would ask someone A S L. <laughs> <laughs> a slash S slash L. <laughs> Sorry. No more music because we'd be copyrighted for it. No, oh, I was going to put on Hell No. Oh, Hell No. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Dana, you know what ASL is? <laughs> age, sex, location. You would ask someone's age, sex, or location. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. All right, your turn. Okay. Can you not read your own handwriting? I can. I'm just looking for one because I got a really good one. Okay, SS. So so. Uh, give me a clue. It's like kind of take a picture on your screen. Screen? It's, oh, it's a screenshot. Yeah. Oh, okay. Ethan, let's switch papers up. You can read this one. All right, little little tick. What's up? Um, let's see. Well, just a moment. Sorry. Not me. Well, you're supposed to guess with us. Okay, so ligma. Ligma? Yeah. Like lick my? No, ligma. L i g m a. No idea. Okay. Ligma is part of the Boso spectrum spectrum of conditions. It and is. I thought it was just a joke. Like, and, uh, like, some people say, ligma balls. 
or like they go like this. They like they go under their they go under the chin or the or here, and they like flick it kind of, and they say balls itch, or they say <laughs> coffee you gay. Oh my god. Right. Okay, moving on. All right. Uh, if okay, what about this one? Uh, see, I kept it G rated. You guys gotta keep it G rated. We are. Uh, yeah, that one wasn't. Uh, TT, <laughs> if you're if you're if you're texting someone and you said TTFN, to the effing man. No. <laughs> no, Dana. Ta 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 for now. You, did you know that one, Abel? What the no. heck? No. All right, you're up. Okay. 420. Uh, move, I know what 420 is. Move on. Why do you kids know what 420 is? No, 420. When they're going to be my turn. Ready to guess, Mom? It's when adults smoke. that can smoke marijuana smoke. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was going to be like... <laughs> April 20th. Got lit. I thought it was like... So lit, lit, yeah. I thought lit meant cool. They're, they get like lit because of like Snoop Dogg. Oh, Snoop Dogg. Mm. Mm. Like, okay, don't, all right. Don't do that now. Ethan, you're up. Okay. Keep Ethan. it G-rated. Dang Gina. Get what? I freaking have it. D-A-M-N Gina. I have no idea. Use this straight or wait. If somebody finally earned their PhD, for instance, you could say, Dang Gina, look at you. If if you throw back to Martin Lawrence's 90s um, sitcom, Martin, in which he regularly used the phrase when addressing his wife, Gina, Tisha Campbell, Camp P. Bell, Martin. So you've never used this one? No. These are ones you gotta be. These are ones you have to oh, use. Yeah. You can't just, these are ones that we. Daddy, why you can't look? Yeah, he can. Oh, okay. That's why I use. That's why I wrote down the papers. Oh, okay. Okay, Abel's gonna. Abel's gonna question me on it. Okay. All right, Abel, go ahead. What is L O? L L. L O L. What is L O L? O L L. Laugh out loud. Is that right? My favorite. No. No. Oh. Yep. That's what it is. No, it's not. Okay. Okay. okay all right. All right. If back in the day when me and your mom were, were typing and we typed W Y S I W Y G. That's too much. No, it ain't. What is it? Yeah, give me the pen. Freaking. Well, say it again. If we were typing W Y S I W Y G, what would me and your mom be saying? With your. Am I getting it right so far? No. Um. We were G-rated kids for one thing, so it's nothing like... When you no. see, I, wing... No. What you see you is mean. what you get. What? <laughs> what you see is what you get. You used to do that? <laughs> no, I, I never did that. I never did messaging, but these kids all do. Okay. All right. Give me one that you guys actually say. Okay. Dubs. Why is it all about drugs with you? No, it's, no, it's not. not. It's dubs. D U B S? Yes. 20 inch rims. What? <laughs> when I was a kid. Like, if you win in a game, you're like, ooh, I get these. I got these dubs, boy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. No, it's like, it's like on the Fortnite. Like, you win a game of Fortnite, and you're like, we got that dub. And what like, that that's mean? not how you say it. What you're does like, it mean? What, what we got some dubs, boy. And that, so, what does it mean? Okay. It means like wins. Wins. Yeah, okay. See, so when we were younger, dubs were twenty-inch rims you put on your car. All right. What about this one? What about this one? Uh, pwned. Postponed. I postponed our plans because I just want to sleep. No, you should know this. You're a gamer. What does pwned mean? Like mark or something? Like you mark a location? No. Pwned it means you've been owned so hard you've been pwned. Oh, I get that, yeah. What, 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 what does pwned mean? It means you've been owned so hard that you're now pwned. Like, 
You want to know where it comes from? The guy who created one of the creators of World of Warcraft when he was typing. Adam, when, one more word. One more word, then you're done. <laughs> more than then, I'm done. Then we're swimming. Okay, all right. Well, hang on, hang on. Okay, uh, you kids are up. <laughs> you kids are up. Okay, I got one. It has to be one that you use. It is, yeah. I got one. Me and Madison use this a lot. All right, go ahead. Okay. Sister snatched. <sighs> Sister snatched. Your sister took something. Nope. No. A phrase made by James Charles. It means to be looking very good or your makeup and hair is on point. Or like, or like, um, like, say someone has big lips, they're like, Big what? Lips. Big lips. Big lips. Do you know what quaking is? Quaking? Yes. Uh, no. What's quaking? It's like shook. Shook? Yeah. Like if someone has big, big lips, they're like, oh my gosh, Kylie Jenner is sister shaking or like sister quaking right now. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Abel, you got one? You say it, Mom. He wants to know if you know what TBH means. To be honest. No. 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 Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. You kids probably don't. You guys probably don't yeah. know this. Yes. Is it? Okay. You guys Yay. probably don't know this. Being friends with Tom. If you were friends with Tom, what what were you? What were you doing? Being bad. No. Being bad. Ethan. What? If one of your friends were Tom, probably your first friend, what what kind of account did you have? Account or count? Account. A bad one? No. Tomcat. MySpace. Your first friend on MySpace was Tom. It was always Tom. Oh. And you could never delete them, right? Right, yeah. What the freak is MySpace? Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> it was Facebook before Facebook. Okay, Facebook is for old people. Is it my turn? Uh, yeah, go ahead. Jeanette. Is it appropriate? Yeah, Jeanette. Okay. Is this off of a TV show? No. Okay, uh, Jeanette. You probably don't even use this one. Uh, yeah, I do. I have no idea. It's instead of saying a bad word. It's like a mule. Uh, like a last one Jeanette. word. Last right. okay. one uh, word. I got it. All right, go, Maddie. And a oop. You made a mistake. All right, Can I do another one because I went fast? Okay, all right, go ahead, go ahead. Um. You have a whole paper of them. I know, um, uh. Player. It's something that Ethan is. Oh, uh. Yeah, dude is always like playing tricks on women and stuff. Ethan does that? Ethan's always playing the women, dude. Play means like I got one of Madison's friends. Uh, Abel, you Abel, you got one? Boy. Abel, you... Boy. Uh, boy. How you kids use boy? Yeah. It's like, uh... Uh, like a, like... Uh, what boy, what are you talking about? Yeah. It's like an exclamation, right? Last one will work for you, then you're done, and then we're swimming. We, we are almost done, Abel, then we'll go swimming. Okay, what about this one? What about this one? Dana said this one all the time. Getting jiggy. <laughs> getting jiggy Dude. with it? Getting jiggy with it. Like getting down? To dance or putting the moves on the opposite sex. All right. It, who's, uh, who's up? Tight. Oh, that one. They still use that. Tight, man. means cool. That's tight. No. What? Yes, it does. No, yeah. it's fat, fixed, fastens, or closed firmly, hard to move. Under that's the actual. Oh my god! That's the <laughs> actual. Stop googling stuff. That's the actual definition. No, of like type. I mean, like no, no, no. It means like, oh, yo, that girl's tight. <gasps> yeah. Oh, now she got a big butt. Yeah, like, and then she, and then her something is really tight. <laughs> oh, my. oh, okay. What do you her muscles watching yeah, yeah. watching TRL? What are you watching? T. Which show? TRL. The Jimmy Fallon show. No, <laughs> Ethan. Watching TRL. What are you watching? Uh. Truly 
right literature. Um, Total Request something? Total Request Live on MTV. Oh. Okay. All right. I'm going to go through stuff. I'm going to go through stuff that I actually said and I still say. Okay? Okay. Down. Oh, I got it. Get like down off the counters. No. no, like you're looking sad and stuff. No. No, I'm down for that. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. We use that. We yeah, still yeah, I still use it. Well, uh, I didn't. I don't still use this, but uh, I used to when I was a kid. Fart knocker. <laughs> Fart knocker. Fart knock knocker. Knock on the floor, the door. No, it means an idiot. I mean, you're a fart knocker. Okay. I know. Wife beater. If I'm wearing a wife beater, what's a wife? Oh, beater? yep. It's a. Person it's a. Uh, their wife. No, it's a. No, it's a shirt that has strap like these. I wear them sometimes. It's a ta- uh, men's yeah, tank. tank top. Top. Men's tank top. Uh, okay, what about this one? <clears throat> what about this one? Like, yeah, man. Yeah, man. I say that one. I, I still say this Ooh, one. Oh, I got a good one. Yeah, like, man, yeah. I talk to your uncle all the time. Yeah, man. Like, they say, hey, you want to, like, go to the club later? Like, yeah, man, let's go. <laughs> yeah, man, there you go. Uh, okay, this is one I used to use as okay, a kid. I got it. Well, hang on. Oh. This one I used to use as a kid. It is not politically correct and it's inappropriate. And it's not nice, but I would say that's Jewish. I, w- I say it a lot, yes. but I grew out of it. Stupid. No, not stupid. Dana, that's Jewish. That's Jewish? That's weird. Something that's cheap or crappy. Oh. It's not correct, that's but that's weird. what. What about this? What, I still use this one all the time uh, sideways. I lay down sideways. No. I farted on you sideways. Like if we decide to we decide to take the dogs out and Adele runs away, I'd be like, no, well that went sideways quick. Oh, like wrong. Something that didn't go as planned or it oh. Okay, what about this one? What about this one? I if I was if I was in high school, I'd probably call your mom this. Dirty legs. <laughs> Big thighs. No, oh! no, <laughs> no. It's an old term my grandpa taught me. Dirty legs. I'll tell you after the podcast. Sexy legs. No, no. Mm. It's opposite. Okay. Uh, what about this one? This is an old one that I use. Bogart. What is it? Bogart. I've heard that. But like if, when you guys cook popcorn, you won't let me eat. I'm like, don't bogart the popcorn. Oh, um, um, you hog it. Hog. Yeah, hog it. Or, yeah, keep it. Okay, all right. Uh, what about this one? All right, then. Like, already then? Like my grandma says, if we don't... Oh, my gosh. Like, mom's like, all right, then. Give me that phone if you're not going to do it. Yeah, well, I use it more, <laughs> I use it more of a, a way it to... It works. I use it more of a way to like end a long conversation that I that I don't want to keep talking to someone, or if like oh, I'm like on the. Oh, like if I'm telling you something, you're like, all right. All right I don't want then. To hear you anymore. No, I'm just like, all right then. Me and Seth used to say, uh, all right, or Artie Manuel, because David would be on the phone and you'd go, all right, man, all right. He'd say, all right, man, all right, man. You used to say. So Artie Manuel. Oh, I got a good one. He's <laughs> never gonna. You and Grandma used to say bye. And I was like, why do you say that? Hang on, like sir. Hang on. Okay, what about this one? What about this one? I, t- uh, I tell this to you all the time because you are the slowest person I ever met. Put your ankles into it. Like, go faster. Yeah, it means you step on the gas pedal so hard that your ankles are into it. It's from a movie. All right, two more, then you guys can give me two. Okay. Uh, stoked. I use this one all the time. Oh, oh like, I'm stoked. Or, yeah. like, down to do yep. that. Or, like, that's. Oh, sorry. Turn your freaking No, it was an ad. No, turn your phone off. I did. What about this? What about this? Uh, preppy. Preppy. I've heard that before. Your mom was probably preppy in high school. No. Oh, um, uh. That's like season. feisty or. Brat. Brat. No. I'm just Me. kidding. No, no. Shallow punk little rich kids that think they're better than everyone. Oh. Preppies. Oh, you probably were. Because grandma and grandpa are rich. Because. You got mad when the coach told you to go faster, so you quit the swim team. <laughs> <laughs> they told you to put your ankles into it on the swim team? Okay, I got one. All right. Two more. Oh, no, what, what about uh, skank? One more. Do they, do they use skank? 
Yeah, we use skank. Yeah. What's like, a skank to you? Dirty. It means like dirty um, or like a hoe. That's what a dirty leg is. <laughs> all right, okay, all right. Two more from you guys, and then I got some trivia, and then we'll wrap it up so we can go back and go swimming. Okay. We'll get there. So give me two. Give me one. Give me one. Can I do two and she does two? Sure. Okay. Hurry 90s. up. 90s. The generation of the 90s, man. 1990s. No. Oh, God. I, what? It's a Fortnite term. It's like where you're building, and then I, like, spin around 90 degrees and then, like, build 90 degrees with my walls and ramps and floors and then my next one is that makes no sense bloom bloom b-l-o-m b-l-o-o-m i'm afraid to even ask what is it you probably don't even use any of these Just a minute. You say you don't use it if you gotta look it up. No, like no, I'm no, I'm reading it. What, what does it mean? Oh, each time you fire a weapon, bullet out of a weapon that ha- has a bloom, it will land somewhere within your crosshairs. You know what I mean? Like your crosshairs are like that, no. and then there's a dot, and then it goes in between somewhere where your crosshairs are. Okay. Okay. The bullet. All right. Okay, so. This is spelled K S K S K S K S K S K S. All right, Danny, you're gonna have to help me on this one. What? Oh, it means you're it means you're laughing stupidly. Wow. Kind of. That's and it, sad. And it goes with a Vasco girl. Vasco. V A S C O. Vasco girl's the next one. Yeah, and they use Anna Oop and Oof too. Only sometimes. Though. What is Oof? It's, it's like, a Roblox thing. It's, it's whenever like whenever you die on Roblox. No, oof. or you like make a mistake. You're just like oof, or you don't want to answer something. You're just like oof. Yeah. Oh, by the way, guys, um, if you want to play Fortnite with me, um, add me at. Are you are you e. plugging stuff on my <laughs> podcast? No, capital E. The rest is lowercase. You are M-A-N. too. <laughs> okay, it's E man one two three five zero. The E is capital, and nothing else is capital. I can't Even believe you just plugged Have you ever heard of double part. twist? <laughs> no. What's a is double, like I, twist, double twist? I told you one day. I was joking around. I said, like you du- play I said double twist. Times? And you said, what? And oh, I, I said, uh, that's how. Yeah, at, what was it mean? At school. Like, whatever. Oh, and go like oh. and subscribe. It was double twist. Oh, yeah. Go, fo- go subscribe to Laserbeam. Um, He's the best YouTuber. What about uh, WWJD? Oh, come on. Okay, let me try to explain this. Okay, Vasco is like kind of like a basic girl. They use these. Oh, I forgot what the freaking name was. And then they use scrunchies all the time. They always like do, they have Vasco sleepovers and stuff like that. They use metal straws and stuff and all that. And they're like, oh my god, save the turtles and stuff like that now. They're basic? Yeah. I know what basic means. Me and Dana were watching a show. Wait. Well, yeah, we were watching a show when they were calling mm. each other. It means dumb or something? No. What does it mean? It means like... Uh, well, I stood up and you said, you're so basic. I was just, <laughs> saying, <laughs> it. I was just saying it because they were saying it. I don't know what it means. It means like you're really basic. Like you only have a style, one style. You don't like go for other Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Like, I'm extra, but I'm basic. Like... Okay, all right. This yeah. this episode's getting long in the tooth. Means it's getting long. Abel wants to go swimming. So now, hey, okay. So we're we're gonna do trivia, then we're gonna wrap it up and go swimming. Okay. So I'm gonna. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna ask you, what do you know? Then games are. Do I know what what is? Games. Games? Yeah, when you're working out and you get muscles. Oh, yeah. Okay. Do you know what ice is? Ice is. Ice. Money. No. Uh, oh, ju- wow. like ju- diamonds, diamonds. Jewelry, no. yeah, jewelry, yeah. yeah. But that's a drug, too. Well, yeah. yeah. No, it's but, not. Well, yeah. No, it's not. You're correct, so don't ever worry about it. Uh, okay, trivia. I took slang terms from all different eras, 1950s, 1930s, 1970s, okay? Okay. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you the slang term. You try to guess what it means. Okay. All right, Abel, Dana, Maddie, Ethan, here we go. If I said flutterbum, 
What would I be talking about? Flutter bum. Oh, like a uh, you got a thing. You got a like it's like a somebody's mad and they're like a bummed out and stuff. Big butt. Uh, good guess, but no, huh? Thick. Big uh, n- no, to compliment a gentleman's appearance. Oh. Like if you saw Abel cross the room, you're like, man, he's a flutter bum. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right. What about and then this? he would probably be like, stop looking at me. What about this one? This one's from the 1950s. What if I said, uh, I'm on my way to Fat City? Um, I'm on 1950s. My way. I'm on my way to Fat City. Oh, like McDonald's. McDonald's. Rich City I'm on my way like to McDonald's. A really rich city. Or like really, Cl- uh, really, uh. You're close. Big city. You're close. What'd you say? McDonald's. <laughs> no, it means... <laughs> It means you're. It's it's a way. To, it's a 1950s way of saying you're on your way to the good life. You mean your yeah, po- You got that's... cash in your pockets and everything. Yeah. Okay? All right. What if I called? What if I called Maddie a Clyde? I'm like, Maddie, you're such a Clyde. I'm clumsy. Dana. That's what I'm just thinking. Like. So no, it's a. It means if you didn't like someone, they'd strike you as an idiot. I wasn't actually calling you. I just saw you, so just relax. I actually, I actually do this one to Dana all the time. She gets all pissy at me. What if I called? What if I said Dana had a pizza face? Like you got a pizza face going on. You have a red face. No. Matt. What do you mean? What did you just say? If I said Dana, did you get that off the proactive commercial? Oh, oh like no. oh okay. So um, mom looks like she's all like melted inside and. No. What? Uh, if, I said, if I said Dana, you got a pizza face. It's a 1950s way of making fun of someone who had a lot of acne, pimples. Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. What about this one? What if I said? What if I called you Peepers? Oh. Wow. What if I called you Peepers? Yeah, glasses or like is nosy. Well, glasses. Yeah. The people yeah. listening to this and don't see me, they probably think that really big thighs. <laughs> what about this? What, what, what about this? What if I said old lady? Oh, this girl, like old fashioned? Slow. No, it's, it's a term of endearment for your girlfriend or wife. Like, I can't go out tonight. I got to go spend time with the old lady. Oh, okay. Yeah, like your wife. Yeah. Your grandma, you could probably, uh, your grandma will probably use these. What if you said, uh, uh, well, like, yeah, grandma uses foam domes. Oh, Kathy, oh Kathy McConnell uses one. foam domes. I got one. Hang on. Can I say it? Boom. Kathy McConnell uses foam domes. Oh, like she recycles. No, not even close. <laughs> Dana, the act of stuffing your bra is what girls used to say back in high school in the 50s. Grandma says that. She got breast implants? <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. What about this? What? <laughs> I, I, get, I get called this all the time. I get called this all the time. Square. <laughs> like Adam, you're so square, man. The guys on the podcast call me. Like a square me. face. No. I'm strong. No, not cool. I'm uh, like, uh. not cool and lame. Uh. What about this? What if I said, man, you're such a fink. You're not hanging out with us tonight because you're a fink. Oh, because you're that's your last name, and no, and because, and because you uh, lie all the time. Uh, well, I'm close. Kind of no, you'll get like. Too drunk and you'll. Like, and that means you're a snitch or a tattletale. Oh, snitches aren't a thing. They're just something somebody telling the truth. Like if somebody calls you a snitch, it's. Well, you, you don't. Want, you have to tell no, them a to snitch say, is where they do something small, but then someone tells on them. No. Nope. Yeah, you don't want to be part of the mob and be a snitch to the mob. Then you wind up sleeping with the fishes. Okay, what about this? What if someone tells you to sit on it? Oh, like you forget about it. And yeah. Like, yeah. And just leave it in the past. That makes sense, and but don't no. don't talk about it again. Close. It's a nice way of saying shut up. Oh. Who famously said sit on it all the time? Um, Bob Marley? Bob Marley? Uh, <laughs> Fon- <laughs> Fonzie from Happy Days. I don't know who that is. All right, two more. Bob Marley. Two more. Your mom, I accuse your mom of this all Can the time. Can I the last one? Hang on a second. Okay. Your mom does this all the time. Fake bake. I'm like, Dana, what are you? Fake bake. Fake bake, Dana. I don't do it all the time. Yo, yo, pizza face, foam dome. <laughs> fake bake. Like you're really fake right now. 
She uses a tanning salon. Ooh, yes, I got a good one. Oh. All right, okay, last one, last one. Can I do ASMR at the end? Can what? Can I do ASMR at the end, please? You're what? Can I do ASMR at the end? Yes, yeah, but we got to hurry up and get out of here. Okay, last one. Can I do it? Hang on a second. Well, if I said Monet. I'm like, oh, Man. money, money, money. No. Well, if I'm like, that chick is so Monet. Oh, hot, pretty, or like feisty, sassy. No. It Monet is a painter, so if someone who looks really oh. good far away, but when they get up close, you're like, whoa. Yeah. Oh, kind of like a butterface. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, a butterface isn't that like a really mean way to say like the body's good, but the oh, face yeah, is yeah. everything. Uh, everything is good about her butterface. Yeah. There you go. That's really derogatory. Foam domes. <laughs> paper. Uh, okay. Anyway, do your last one. It better be appropriate. Do your okay. last one. Maddie, go ahead and do your ASMR. No, we're going to close the podcast with the ASMR. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Which is another thing you kids do that I don't understand. <laughs> um, what was it? Clickbait. Oh, yeah, that's when uh, you're, you you lie to get people's attention and then... You yeah, like on YouTube, people do clickbait. Like their, their um, heading of the video when you click on it. Yeah. Before you click on it, it sa- oh, says like something or shows something. Shares? Shares? Yeah. yeah. All right. You guys, you guys all say goodbye. Abel, say goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ethan, say goodbye. Goodbye. Dana. Goodbye. Maddie. I'm going to do something. Goodbye. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, so next week we'll be back. Next week, uh, me and Abel are going to go swimming right now. Uh, next week we will be back to episode 67 on Supernatural if the guys aren't working. And Maddie wants to close up the podcast with ASMR, another thing of your generation that I don't understand. Uh, I'm going. Okay. Here. You have to be quiet. Okay. Stop. Turn that off. You can't. You can't play that because of. Okay, I gotta go. Matt, uh, everyone wants to go swimming.